We are going to clone three different website designs using two different AI solutions. The first one is using Replit, the second one is using V0. So we're going to balance out and see how V0 versus Replit agent. I said Replit agent this side and V0 this side. Anyways, doesn't matter. We're going to use two different services that claim to be that you can clone any website UI. UI stands for user interface using AI. AI stands for artificial intelligence. Let's get started. First one, I've got V0. And then the second one, I've got Replit agent. So all we're going to do is we're going to give the website URL and ask it to clone the website for us. So the three websites that I've shortlisted, one is Shipfast, which is quite popular among indie hackers, at least on Twitter. The second one is a recent product hunt top topper, like I think day topper. So this is a website, know your users, grow your SaaS, some kind of an analytical software. And the third one is the first one on uh, product hunt recently, take care, control of your bi bills with Pine. I, Honestly speaking, until I recorded this video, I was reading it pills. So I thought like this is some um, AI helping with uh, old people taking their medicines, but it's not pills, it's bills. Uh, we have got the entire website. So we're going to see a couple of things. One, we're going to see how close the website that we cloned is to the real website. Two, we're going to see how far we can take the functionalities to. And three, of course, we're going to see how fast and all the other things that come with this kind of an agent. So first of all, I'm going to go to this link, copy this link, go to Replit agent. Can you please uh, clone this for me? That's all I'm going to say. I'm going to keep the prompt as it is. Can you clone this for me? And okay. Yeah, that's okay. And I've sent this. Now I've gone to V0 and I've sent the same message. Can you clone this for me? So as you can see here, Replit agent is starting the business. And when I say, can you clone this for me? It is starting to read. One thing that I always loved about Replit Agent is you would see uh, if this is the first time that you are seeing me making a Replit Agent video, Replit Agent usually comes up with a plan. Whatever it wants to do, it generally tells me like what it wants to do and then it's going to. So it says, uh, I'll help you clone the Shipfast landing page using React, Shad C and UI. We want to replicate their modern SaaS design. At this point, I just assume that it has whatever it has to do. And I'm going to just say build the initial prototype, nothing else. Uplo approve and approve plan and start. But I'm still skeptical whether it has got the screenshot. Let, let's say uh, approve and plan, approve the plan. Okay. Then I'm going here. This is already into the job. V0 is already into the shop. It took the screenshot, but if you see the screenshot, I think it took the screenshot of what is visible on the screen rather than the entire thing. So if you scroll down, these things are not there. Okay. So maybe we can do screenshot by screenshot, but for now we have got the screenshot and it is desired. It has already designed it. And a good thing with V0 recently is that it creates multiple files. It's not like only one file anymore. It creates multiple file, making it like truly full stack. And uh, if you see here, you have got the same logo, uh, product of the day too. Okay. Yeah. Product of the day too. And uh, ship your startup in days, not weeks. I like, the little highlight here, that's good. But I'm a little surprised that uh, it didn't hold the colors that we want to do. It said press L for the leaderboard. I'm going to press L. Basically nothing happens. Click leaderboard, nothing happened. Pricing, demo, wall of love. Overall nothing happened. Uh, I'm surprised like usually V0 does a much better job, but I'm surprised here. And I'm going to go back to the Replit clone here, which is still happening. So in terms of speed, I think V0 has already done a pretty good job, but we know that Replit agent usually tries to pull off the heavy lever. And uh, in this particular case, it is still going on. So it's, it's trying to use framer motion, um, a bunch of other things. All I'm trying to understand is if they can create or clone that looks exactly like that. I'm not, I'm not asking you to go clone businesses, but that's, that's never a bad idea, right? Amazon cloned what was considered to be Walmart's business or even like book business before. So everybody cloned something and then makes it better. So you can probably clone your thing, but, um, here I'm not like, I'm not, I'm not that, that of a genius to clone somebody's business and become it, make it successful. Otherwise I wouldn't, I wouldn't be running this YouTube channel. I would be like, probably be super rich already. So, uh, Replit agent is still going on two minutes ago. So maybe during that time, I'm going to go, go just like ask V0 something. Um, it doesn't look complete. The color schemes look off. Okay. So it doesn't look complete. The color schemes look off. Okay. 
with that i'm looking forward to see what replay agent is creating which is still going on which we started like probably like three minutes ago so it it takes it pretty seriously whatever it wants to do wow it's taking um it's also taking images from unsplash i'm not even sure if it's like a real photo if i copy the link paste it oh yeah it's a real photo so it's taking photos of humans that are real good thing with replicate agent also very similar like v0 i think it's been before v0 it also creates multiple files it helps you create like a project outlook rather than having like a single page so yeah that's uh, i think that's one uh, good thing with both these systems but v0 is pretty much a front end system but replicate agent as you can see here it's got like database and all the other things going back to v0 um uh, now it's working so it says you're absolutely correct i apologize for the oversight let's improve the implementation to get better match the original design including the dark color scheme why didn't you do this before bro when you wanted me to tell you that you made a mistake so okay still going on i think at this point it is done it is there are change wow it says okay this is the final page okay is this it is asking me it's created a checkpoint which is good at this point can you see the landing page with all the sections okay to be honest there are some things that i like some things absolutely i hate it and i i'll let you judge it i'll i'll let you tell me what do you feel but for now ship your sas faster i think in terms of the landing page like literally where you land the real estate i feel like a v0 did a much better job i mean look at this the color this this i honestly feel like v0 has done a much much better job in terms of color scheme what it has to do um i mean there it's a little bit off like in fact this particular design also featured on hacker news product and twitter and all these things you need to give the images but i think v0 has done a better job of like copying the design per se um and let's let's scroll down and then see i think where replicate agent probably does a better job is i think it gives you even if it is not exact copy let's say you want to build a sas you are trying to take inspiration from somebody okay and even if you are not make you you don't want to make exact copy you, you want like a fully functional website v v0 didn't give you that i mean at least like in my case v0 doesn't give me that because placeholder images are not there like i have to now figure out how to go give placeholder images after add stripe logo mongo db logo next auth logo next js logo mailgun tailwind upload all these humans and all the other things but if i go here let me even click live demo There's nothing happens features it shows me features with a cool animation side click it so it has that cool uh, loading animation pricing yeah just the frame of motion thing testimonials i've got sarah johnson cto tech start michael chen emily rodriguez why do why do i have the picture of a boy like a guy is it a male name david kim yeah we launched our mvp in weeks instead of months roi has been incredible outstanding support is it the same one that they have got here no it's not the same one yeah it's not the same one but i like it i like it the fact that it has managed to do it it's managed to keep the color scheme like it didn't copy exactly but it managed to keep the color scheme intact like whatever color scheme that he tried to come up with the color scheme is intact the icons are beautiful um so yeah again there is one more a place where i can go um sub, sub yeah have, oh there is a validation as well that's that's pretty interesting so i'm going to say one little please include an id in the email address okay there is a server side validation that's pretty 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 interesting that's inter thank you for subscribing to our newsletter wow i didn't know that okay the faq section is nice yeah the the carousel is nice the toggle is nice it is a pretty good job it's it, it's instead of multiplying by 12 it is doing a pretty good job let me go see if it is the same pricing here i don't think it's the same pricing no it's not the same pricing in fact they've got only two plans so okay this is amazing um i i'm not going to say which one is best i think in both the cases like v0 did a pretty, pretty good job of like copying but i think replicate agent did a better job of like still like an artist you're not like copying like a copycat but you have a fully working demo uh, let me know what you feel on to the next one i'm going to go clear my system and uh, stop it go to home 
Okay, I'm going to do the second one. And once again here, I'm going to go start a new chat. Now this time we're going to do this. I'm going to take this website. Maybe I'll, I'll start with the pine. Um, I'm going to take this website, go here. Please clone this website. Try to keep the color schemes as same as possible. Now let's be clear. Huh? Um, send this, start building. Okay, continue. It's going to start. Um, Replicate agent is like a big system because it's not just the front end, it does everything. It generally takes time in this particular case. I want to give the same thing. And uh, please clone this website, 19pine.ai. One thing that I like about uh, V0 in this particular case is it actually shows me what it sees from the website. Like the screenshot is available. So I don't have to be second guessing like whether it understood something, whether it did not understand something. That is like a wonderful feature. I think in terms of like what it is trying to do, which is something that Replit also does it. I, there is a huge difference in speed, I would say. Honestly, like I think V0 is like miles faster than what Replit is doing. So we have got one file top banner, navigation banner, floating icons. Where do we have navigation banner? Okay, this is the top banner maybe. This is nav. And then where are the floating icons? Are these floating icons? Maybe this is floating icon. I don't know. So we have got all these things. But I think the only catch here is that it's not going to the second page and third page. So we can probably figure out a way to do those things. I would love to have this kind of an animation effect. Um, only if I can give a GIF or a video to V0, that would be pretty interesting. So it'll be pretty interesting to see what Replit agent is going to do. I don't think it's understanding all these things. I'll help you create clone of nine. Okay, I will focus match color scheme animation overall. Oh, cool. Okay, I have approved the plan. I don't want to go ahead with um, any other addition. Um, because it generally takes time. So I don't want it to take a lot of time. So but it is it is building, you can see that it has started building with the initial one. It's also very interesting that it 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 explains it to me like, you know, I'm completely like a dumb guy trying to make something possible. So it's like, Oh, I'll help you clone this, which is it's repeating, it's giving me the stack using react, we will focus on matching their color scheme, animations, overall design aesthetic, exactly. Bro, I hope you do it. It's not just like what you promise. Um, but again, it's, I saw a link there as well. So maybe like there is, wow. This is amazing. I mean, look at this. This is what we try to copy. Okay. Just from the first screenshot, the top bar, the nav bar, this, and this is what we copied. Look at this italics here. I don't know if the font is also same. To be honest, I'm not sure if I can see the font. This is fine. What is a font here? It's a font UI serif Georgia Cambria. Okay. I don't know if I'm looking at the right thing, but this is quite insane. Like it's unbelievably good. Look at the font. Oh no, it's, it's, it's slightly different. Front says italic. But it's pretty good. I mean, it doesn't do everything, but it has this. It doesn't have the icons. It has this floating icons or whatever it says, like the floating icons. There is like a page for you to use. And um, yeah, so there is page, floating icons, navbar, top banner. It understood the components that are required in the visual uh, visual section. The color scheme is insanely correct. I mean, look at the, look at the phone icon. I mean, the icon is different. Look at the phone icon. There is the detail, the dollar one. It's like purple and indigo. We have got the car. We have got the car here. Um, that's quite amazing. I mean, if you tell me that, you know, I hired an intern to redesign this website or copy this website, I would be like, your intern is an amazing designer. That's, that's the, per that's, that's what I would think. But the only ca ca case here is that this is like only one one uh, screenshot, like one website, um, the landing one. And this is still going on. Oh, it's it's asking me. Cool. Let's go back to the new tab. Uh, it's very different, very different from what we gave. I think it's kind of maybe hallucinating at this point. Artificial intelligence for the future. I don't I'm not sure if it is looking at the you know, now at this point, I'm actually wondering if it is looking at the screenshot or just making up stuff. I mean, there is some kind of a payment thing. So maybe it understood it's a payment thing. Okay. Let me, let me do one additional step. Okay. 
I'm going to take a scrolling screenshot. Okay, capture, scrolling capture. I'm going to take a scrolling capture and uh, I'm going to see if it can actually do it. Was I supposed to scroll? How do I take a scrolling screenshot? Scrolling capture. Okay, after I think keep it like this. Like this. It didn't scroll. Strange. Okay, let me. Did it do the job? Okay, if you're running modification. Okay, so maybe, you know what, I'm going to just copy this. I'm going to give it. Sorry, it seems uh, you missed the colors and design. I've given this. It's asking me how do you feel the overall design? I mean, this is a good website, but it is not copy. I mean, that's, that's the whole point, right? So I'm not looking for a designer. I'm looking for a designer who can make a replica so that, um, you know, I can say that I feel inspired. I like a lot of things it does. And the animation is pretty good. There's a form here. There are images are placeholders from Unsplash, which is kind of brilliant at this point because a lot of services I've felt, uh, this is a big pain. Maybe we can go here and then try. Um, Okay, um, this is, uh, this, I'm going to give the page, this page. This is, uh, this is another page. This is like a features page. This is another page down after scrolling. Can you add it? But yeah, I think the color aesthetic is pretty interesting in this case. The job it has done top notch. I think V zero clearly, clearly, clearly has, uh, been better than replicate in this particular case, uh, at least like for this particular use case of copying the landing page in this particular case, it does a pretty good job. Um, I, I, yeah, I think maybe I would have to give, uh, the screenshot itself, I guess. So it's restarting the development server. Uh, it has made a bunch of changes in terms of color and the other things. So, okay. It's taking a screenshot. I'm going to open it in a new tab. It's loading the changes, open it in a new tab. So it's giving me this, um, I think it's got kind of like messed up with the color scheme, maybe like the dark theme, but it still sticks to the same kind of, um, I mean, there is the attention to details. If you see, there is a huge difference between V zero and this. So for the third one, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just give a screenshot in both the cases and then see what is going to happen. So go back to replit. Yeah. It added the, wow. This is, this is cute. It is actually cute. I mean, it doesn't move in this particular case, but this is cute. The colors are good. It is not the same card. It's a card. Great job, uh, V zero. So this is going to be the final thing that we're going to do. We're going to take a screenshot of this. Maybe <laughs> let me have a smaller size. Okay. I'm going to copy this. This please clone this website. It's got three sections as you can see from the screenshot to copy this. I'm not going to give a URL in this case. Okay. So start building continue. I'm going to paste the image. I can just copy this from here. Send it. Website clone request. Interesting. Replicate agent is getting connected. It's trying to do. So from this until this point, like there are a couple of observations. One, of course, V zero is extremely fast. The attention to detail for V zero to clone. Like we're talking about cloning, like literally you want, you want like the exact twin. And this is V zero is like pretty good with that exact twin that it can produce. Yeah, I don't, I don't need authentication system, real time processing, add more analytics chart, maybe like add more analytics chart. Let's see what happens. And, uh, it's trying to do its job. Let's go back to V zero. It's already done. Yeah. I think in this particular case, kind of like the screenshot is messed up. It's got like the product and as the name instead of the, a uh, badge and uh, know your users, grow your SaaS. Good. Uh, it doesn't have the same glow and all those things. I think the. 
some mistake over the color scheme. Um, this almost looks like a website with a design with framer, I guess. I don't know. Um, there's, there's like a cute animation going on here. There is nothing here. And yeah, I think one thing that I don't like about V0 is like, it doesn't add the placeholder images. Maybe we can ask it. Um, so, sorry, sorry, bro. Um, the color schemes are off. The buttons don't have the same glowing animation. Not sure if that's what you call it. And um, I don't want to go through the pain of adding placeholder images. Can't you do that? Like from some service like Unsplash. Anyways, just give me your best work. Done. And going back to Ripple it, Ripple it is done. Okay. Yeah. Ripple it has done a job. Know your users, grow your SaaS. Pretty good. Wow. Would you believe that, that you have an interactive chart? This is not even interactive. When the guy who created this product, who's like on the top of product and doesn't even have the interactive chart, but a Replit agent created the interactive chart for me. I mean, um, at this point, this is like crazy. Yep. Yeah, I've got like three o'clock, six o'clock, nine o'clock. Is that the same chart? Yep. Yeah, I've got the same chart, like top sources, visitors, and all these things and, uh, built for modern applications, real time. Wow. Look at the glow here. I mean, there is no glow around this. But look at the glow here. You can see the glow. I think you can see the glow. The pretty interesting. Real time event monitoring. Oh, collection has been detected. Yeah, this is cool. This is pretty cool. Um, and it kind of like stuck with the color combination. There's a, like a gradient here. Uh, the button doesn't have gradient. Okay, maybe I can go say um, all looks good, uh, but the buttons don't seem to have the glowing. Uh, moving animation around it. Let's see. I'm, I mean, I don't know if you can see this. There's some kind of animation around this. Something that you are, you can see here like that. So I've, uh, I've asked for a change. Let's see. So it's uh, making some changes. This it's, it says this version should be closer. Why why would you add like a Netflix logo to product? Okay. There is a glowing animation. Uh, I wouldn't deny, but it is not exactly what I wanted. It added the placeholder images. I think all you have to do is ask for it. Where did it add it from? Let's go. Oh, it added it from Unsplash. That's cool. In fact, it added a chart from Unsplash. This is super cool. Built for modern applications, real time event tracking, real time event monitoring. The same image, isn't it? Yeah, the same image. This is cropped here. This is not cropped. In fact, it added an image that actually has website analytics. That's pretty interesting to know and uh, get started. View documentation is scrolled on. Beautiful, beautiful work by Replit. Uh, sorry, beautiful work by V0. Replit, what kind of animation is this? Um, let me go see. Um, it's it's a very similar type of animation. I, I don't think I like this animation, but Replit, you have done a good job. I, I don't want to, I don't want to say anything further, but at this point, let me know what you feel, which service is better. But I think we live in a time where it's, easier for you to steal like an artist. If you, if you know what I mean, there is a famous book thing, Austin, Austin Cleon, I guess if, if I remember his name, but anyways, everybody likes to attribute it to like Pablo Picasso, steal like an artist. Um, what do you think about these two AI services that can help you steal like an artist? See you in another video. Happy prompting.